Additionally, how auto component industry in India has operated is that they, they, they talk about their value proposition in terms of money and, you know, access to land and access to the customer, never really on the technology. But uh, very much difference here is you need to have your own IP, your own technology. If you're operating in uh, very critical areas such as anode manufacturing, cathode manufacturing. Uh, so what's your, you know, plan with the cathode manufacturing? Because these things are really... I mean, beyond imagination kind of thing, honestly, to me, because I have been tracking this industry since long, that Indian companies coming up in anode manufacturing, then cathode manufacturing, building commercial level plants. So how do you plan to build the cathode uh, manufacturing in India and how much time it is again going to take for customer qualification? Is it in the pilot stage or at commercial stage, the company which you have acquired, how it can help you? Yeah, so we acquired a, a tech center from Johnson Matthew in early 24. Mm -hmm. So a lot of IP and a 300 ton pilot plant. Mm -hmm. So actually what that gives us is able to produce samples at mass scale. Right. And we were already qualified with a lot of customers. Mm -hmm. So we are continuing supplying customers. Today our, our cathode, LFP cathode material is an actual two wheelers operating in Asia. Right. So customers are taking it, putting, making cells and it's operating. Okay. Now China has moved on. Mm -hmm. When we acquired the facility, we were at Gen 1.5. Okay. Uh, cathode material, mm. LFP. Uh, we have progressed now to Gen 3. 